So Claudia Jordan confirms that Cocktails with the Queens is being canceled. The show is over with. But let me tell you something. She did not like the shade that was thrown. Let's get into it, y'all. Claudia credit because she checked me respectfully, but she definitely checked me. Let's go ahead and get into what she said. Yes, we do the show via Zoom because we had good numbers without spending money on a studio. Plus, remember, we all live in different states. The show was expensive to produce because we have bigger names on it, so the money is being spent on the talent fees, which, sir, was nowhere near free 99. Not exactly sure you know, if it was a budgeting thing. I, I wonder how much money they even make from it, to tell you the truth. Because honestly, something like that, if you only got to do it one day a week, shit, they probably do it for free 99 with a little promo and shit like that, you know? I, I don't see... Be for real. We have myself, who keeps a bag coming in, and I work very hard and have earned it. Lisa Ray, who ain't doing shit for free. Grammy-nominated Selena Johnson and movie star Vivica Fox. Let's not try so hard to be funny that we get ignorant. It comes on YouTube through Zoom. That's that's how the show come on, uh, through YouTube, through Zoom call. That's how they do the Fox Soul thing. You know, very low budget, saves Fox a lot of money. Plus, everyone was super overbooked with movies, tours, and a million other things. It may be back in some capacity, but it was definitely not a fail. We had three years starting with a pandemic where cocktails helped build the network and viewership shot up 5,000%. Just wanted y'all to have some context and facts. Three years doing a show like this is a win. Claudia, we're both commentators and we're both entertainers. So you get the game. It's nothing personal. I'm just being funny. However, we do the same thing. I do mines on StreamYard and you do yours through Zoom. You know, we both pay $25.99 a month for the program that we use to stream live. <laughs> of course I was throwing shade, but isn't that what they do on their show? I mean, come on, that's why they go viral. So in all seriousness, I did appreciate Claudia coming by and just giving more context to what was going on. So it doesn't seem like there was a problem with the views or anything with the show. It was actually because everybody was so busy. As you guys know, Claudia is in New York and she has been a regular as a guest host on The Breakfast Club. And then also she's doing TGIF with Funky Dineva and Al Reynolds five days a week. So I mean, it kind of replaces the cocktails with the queens. Selena Johnson will be on tour all summer. Lisa Ray is a working actress, and you know Vivica A. Fox, she always keeps some kind of job. So I can see how all their schedules colliding and not being able to actually film the show every Monday. Go ahead and do a further deep dive into the whole Zoom call thing. There's nothing wrong with doing a Zoom call. Hell, I do my show through StreamYard. Same concept, right? However, my issue was that Fox Soul not putting money into the budget for a studio. Now, I know all the girls don't live in the same area or same states. However, there should at least be some kind of studio where the girls who do live in California or wherever Fox Soul headquarters is, they film together and then the rest do, you know, call in via Zoom or something like that. I still go back to if this was Fox Country or predominantly white audience, I do not believe they would just be doing Zoom calls. I believe they would put them into a studio. I still stand behind this. Claudia did state because they don't have a studio, they do have a bigger budget for talent. However, we all know if you invest more money into your business, you will get more income. <laughs> Hold on, let's rewind. What I meant to say, if you invest in your business, you will see more profit. There we go. I just think for us, we should want the best. Am I wrong for that? I know y'all gonna talk about my white walls and my lights or whatever. However, I don't have a budget like Fox Soul. Another option they could have used was just to put in guest hosts when one of the ladies was out. I mean, I think that would have worked perfectly. However, that's here nor there. The show is going away. We do wish Lisa, Claudia, Vivica, and Selena the best of luck. Uh, definitely, Claudia did say it would come back in some kind of capacity. We just don't know when or if it will happen. However, no hate over here, ladies. We appreciate y'all. And thank you, everybody, for watching. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section.
Wait, hold on. Before we end, I do want to say shout out to Anonymous T. Make sure you guys go follow her channel. This is where I first seen that the show was even being canceled. So shout out to her. Definitely want to give her the credit. I will go ahead and put a link to her video in the description of the video. All right, y'all. Deuces.